more concept called team person name styles and format then we will move on to the topic of tree team what is this person name styles or format team see here let me come to let me come to the same hiring screen of the employee team whenever an end user hiring the employee in the system they are coming to my client group the new person hire an employee then if i go to this particular task for hiring an employee team if you could observe the personal details on the very first tab of identification we are going to capture the basic details then personal details national identifier details these are the information we will capture about the hiring employee team particularly this section personal details where we are going to capture the employee personal name okay last name first name title gender date of birth okay then these ignore okay these all are dfs from blood type to till employee office type people created dfs out of that i only defined these three office type project details and employee office type but regularly in the personal details section till date of birth you can see the fields coming up team these are the things now observe the screen carefully what are the attributes are there last name first name title gender date of birth right now see team i will select the legal employer here let's say this jde na operations is in the country of united states means that legal employer created in the country united states now if i try to hire an employee in this us based legal employer you you see the structure here now i am selecting the legal employer the us based company see there is a change in the structure if you could notice last name first name title then something came prefix suffix preferred name some things got added up here now let's say i'm hiring an employee in a canada based legal employer ca that is fusion nine access canada now see observe this personal detail section team see any change that you notice La, uh, first name become non mandatory okay then i will try to uh, hire an employee in any of the indian based companies team let me search with uh, tcs okay uh, in united states only let me search with tata okay okay tata motors but i don't know whether ldgs are added to it or not let's check it out that's why i want any indian based company to show you how the structure is getting changed let me search with registration code as india okay now you see team now i i like to hire an employee in indian based legal employer team now you see the structure in the personal details level title first name last name suffix alias name something came now so this structure is getting updated with respective to the country that we are hiring the employee the moment i choose the legal employer with respect to to that country these structural level changes are happening team so that concept is called as person name styles we have a concept in place called person name styles or format we can customize this attributes according to our country specific in the system team how to do that one go to setup and maintenance okay go to setup and maintenance and then search with a task called workforce deployment and then search with a task called manage person name styles manage person name styles this is the task name team this is manage person name styles click on that respective task and then on the very first section on the person name styles you can see the section called name styles and here you can see all the list of countries available team if you scroll down you can have all the list of countries available here and now if you scroll down team there will be one more section that country respective details team now if i keep my cursor on australia 
Australia details will come here. Currently, it's coming with Argentina as part of Argentina as part of this uh, alphabetical order. Now, if I keep my cursor on Australia, the details section will update with that country. See, Australia I'm selecting. And if I scroll down, now Australia details came. Let's say I, I want to update with uh, Belgium. Select Belgium. Then here, the Belgium details will come. So on the very first section, country list will be there. When you select that country team, the moment I select Canada, if I scroll down, the country Canada details will come. So the person name styles for that country, you can see team. I'm selecting Canada. So here Canada details came and currently see team in Canada, we have these things. Last name, first name, title, prefix, suffix, middle name, honors, known as, previous last name. Okay. So when we hiring an employee in Canada based legal employer team, see the attributes accordingly will come. So if I'm trying to hire an employee in United States, okay, if I go to USA, where is it? Let me search here, United, okay, United States. If I select it, these all are the US based uh, attributes team. Last name, first name, title accordingly, the display options will come here. Now, what I will do, team, I will go to India. Let's say I will search with India also. When I come to India, I have these components available, team. Okay. Let me try to hire an employee in Indian based legal employer. See, team, title, first name, last name, suffix, alias name, prefix. Okay. See, prefix, alias name, suffix, previous last name. That also there, right? My that is not coming. I think someone hired that component already. Okay. Title, first name, middle name, last name. These all things are coming. See, title, first name, last name, suffix. So here we have the scope team. Whether you want to add more attributes but by default for every country standardly oracle defines certain format scheme now if i want to add any custom combination on top of oracle delivers let's say click on plus icon team then you can add the sequential order here whatever the display sequence coming accordingly the display also will be there title is coming on top why title is having the lowest value 10 then next first name is coming because that is having 20 next step after 10 20 so in the sequential order they will get displayed team. let's say i am giving something five and then i will go to name component team. now a part of okay a part of uh oracle delivered attributes like first name honors title last name team i have the other availability see name information 15 to name information uh, 30 they are the available attributes to make use team so i will use something here name information 16 15 was already used and i give something like team father name i want to capture father name also and when i am giving this display name here that will display in the front end whatever we are keeping as a display name that will showcase in the front end team. That will be displaying name on the front end. The attribute, this father name will store in the back end tables will be in that name information 16. By default, standard attributes will deliver by Oracle, like first name, honors, known as last name, then a prefix, suffix, title. These all will be given. On top of that, more 15 attribute provisions will be given to define our own custom fields on the person name uh, styles team. So now I'm creating a custom field called father name and that I'm creating under this name component sequence five I am giving. If I keep required in the front end, the field come with star coated like this. Why first name and last name coming as star coated? For first name and last name, the required flag enabled here. That's why team. other attributes are not enabled with required. That's why they're coming with optional. See, so if you want to make your field mandatory in the front end, keep it required team. Now you click on save and close, save and close. Okay, now you go back. Let me 
uh, go back and come in freshly because simultaneously we are doing so changes will get reflected in some time so now see team i am trying to hire an employee in indian based legal employer see father name came and it's on it's on the top of the list see about title it stood why why display sequence if i come now if i come now to the country india okay see father name stood first the display sequence arrangement team whatever that ascending to descending the position will be there here team father name came with star quote that is because of this required if i am removing this required here team let's say say one close then i will just go back once again and come in again now let me hire an employee in indian based legal employer now see father name came as optional star quoted removed from here so like this this particular section only the personal details section while we hiring the employee can be customizable depending upon the country that you are hiring the employee it's not about the legal entity or legal employer it's about the country in which you are hiring the employee team that if you want to customize you have the option called person name styles okay okay now team one more thing i want to tell you while we hiring the employee team in the personal details level only we have something called enter local name what is this one team i am getting from here to here some attributable details team if i click on enter local name the same bunch of copy i will get on the right side the same attribute see now see father name to till prefix till prefix the same bunch i got here also team but there is something called local name language what is that oracle given as a provision that whenever the employee being hired in the system if the client expecting that they want to capture the employee name in their local language in some countries team they will have their traditional names particularly if you implement a project in china they will have their regular name but as well as they will have some traditional chinese name which is in chinese so that kind of local names if they want to capture for the employees they can go with this one team they can choose their language and they can capture in that particular language team but that your keyboard should be supported with that local language also it's up to the client interest if they are expecting this is optional if you uncheck it won't come just you can capture the respective details and proceed for the team but this local name also you can make it as mandatory with respect to country how come to the country same person name styles search your country now this is about india and these are the attributes we have team now here at the country level there is something called team local name required if i check box this one what happens you see now i'm saving and close okay now come back to hire an employee click on cancel okay now try to hire an employee team then i am coming to legal employer you observe carefully now what happens i am i am coming to legal employer and i am trying to hire an indian based legal employer see team this enter local name became mandatory i am not having an option to remove this flag see it came mandatory why because at the back end at the country level you have make it as required if you come to person name styles for the country india you made that local name enabled here team if you are not enabling then it will come in a optional way it's hr will and the wish if they want to uh, capture the local name or not now see the screen if i come back and then if i am trying to hire an employee in that legal entity or legal employer see lo a local name is optional i can select it will come if not i can switch off that so this personal details customization will be there with respect to the country in the system team so it depends upon your client's requirement by default for every country oracle defines standard attribute scheme on top of that if anything that our client expecting a part of dff creation you can also 
create the custom fields at least in the name section at the personal details level through the task of person name styles team that is what the concept of person name styles are